Commando was a huge fucking disaster. But this wasn't, and no, it wasn't that bad. It cost bad. tons of people their jobs, their livelihoods, uh, all to please you, Willie. Are you it, happy? I'm, I'm ecstatic. Ben Judd, you did great. All 26,000 of me <laughs> applaud your shit. You know, Willie, you're a straight shooter about how, how cavalier you are with other people's livelihoods and jobs and families. And I can't fault you for that. You know, Pat once said, like, I'm such an astute... You guys play Xenogears? <laughs> Immediately after that, he said, Willie, you, the reason why you defend Bionic Commando and, uh, so hard in all its iterations is because it's the first game where you can actually relate to the main character because it's a guy wearing green with dreads. And I was like, fuck, you have an actual point. No, I thought it was like, fuck you, Pat. Fuck, you have yeah, a yeah, point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Damn it. Like, I, it wasn't random white protagonist dude. It wasn't any of that. It was the guy I can relate to. It wasn't Nathan Drake or it wasn't Bald Space Marine. It, it was, was Spencer in the future coming out of jail being a badass. And I'm like, you took a franchise I love you, and you made him look like something I really like. I can, I, I, come on. Also that menu. But anyway, rearmed. This we should have a playthrough of, of the console Bionic Commando, but we don't. We just do the menu, and then that's the end of the video. <laughs> oh man! I'll do the menu. It'd be so hyped nonetheless, dude. And, and the, I'll, I'll I'll give that game lots of shit for me myself not finding it very fun, but that fucking menu is the bossest menu of God, the entire generation. Man. Um, so we're gonna try to do um, co-op multiplayer. Bionic Bros. And as far as we know, co-op multiplayer might have some issues, maybe. Well... you beat this as single player. Yeah, I, beat, I, never I beat them beat all. It. I never beat it because it's super hard. But it's like, it, it's not... Well, it was hard for me. No, well, it just, you get, you don't have a jump button, you get used to it, you know, it's fine. But no, but two-player mode, they change some of the patterns around, and like, things you have to do are like, multiplied and all that, right. so... So, I have to reiterate, people, there's no jump button in this game. So there's gonna be lots of things where uh, I'm gonna be stuck, or uh, someone's gonna be stuck, and we don't know how to get anywhere because you can't jump and you have to go around the long way or whatever. This, all the Johns, just get your Johns out from now. I'll get the Johns John out. John disclaimer. Alright, this is the story of the man I met when I was still young. Why is that even really a thing? Why does it matter if you were still young? Well, when I was a young little whippersnapper. It's like when you talk about how you were, you were uh, Matthew Jr. Yeah, you Matthew always Jr. talk about Matthew Jr. That's, that's what it is. It's like, you know, I was learning... <laughs> this was... is the girl I had a crush on when I was young. And, you know, obviously, she shit gets darker. She didn't like it. It gets darker. That's why. I was still young. War was fresh. We had hotties like this back in the day when I was still young. Now, Haley, despite only showing her face, or, like, what, her lower part of her face, is, you know how fucking hot she is. <laughs> There's just something about her. It's the, it's the tuft. It's the tuft of hair coming from under the helmet and over the glasses. Yeah. You need one sign like that, and you're like, yeah. Just give me a holla! And uh, she'll just cart us around wherever we want to go. There's something about, like... like Who did you make mad to end up with this fucked up duty? There's something yeah. about that the helicopter pilot that's like the cute girl that helps you out and does things like in Deus Ex as well. Yeah, that's true. You know, you're like, yeah, man, you're you're down, you're 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 down. You know, she she'll do what needs to be done to the end. Oh, we don't have to save her like that one thing in, in Bionic Commando. Sorry, in uh, Deus Ex. Deus Ex. Eh. Yeah. Eh. Eh. Yeah. The other thing about this game is that these loading screens seem really elaborate sometimes. Okay. For just a simple. So, okay. I, I am. Would you like to switch? Give me that fucking controller. <laughs> Willie wants to be the green Thank one. Thank you. You could be Char. You could be cool guy with the red and the blonde, right? So we got our shots. Yep. Shots. Our, 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 our standard gun is fucking awful. You got your grap. Really the point. Your grap. 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 Right, and then you got you got to get used to the whole like everything. Yeah, drop off and then swing and then go up and you know. I'm doing it. You'll get the swing of things. <laughs> I don't get it. I really. Do. Oh, sorry. I forgot that this is just. This is a good guy base. Yes. We're just fooling around a good you're, guy you're getting, base. You're getting it all, okay? Fight and enjoy. <laughs> Got it? <laughs> good. All right. Let me start off with some upgrades to our basic weapon. Yeah. So that shoots a bit faster, I'm assuming, you know what or, it is. or what? Uh, you know, that's a good question. We can find out easily by pressing the back button. 
And the rate of fire, rate fire has fire. been increased. There you go. Alrighty. That's good. To That's know. all it takes. Back in the old day, if you shot during those those sections, like the, everything would go on alert mode, and like your your soldiers would start attacking. You, you mean you. like the soldiers think you like went you went over to the other side? You went and rogue. You went nuts. Yeah. Like, why are you like, firing I, on I our own base? I accidentally shot my gun, assholes. I'm not fucking <laughs> turning over to the reds. I'm looking at my controller. I have two options here. <laughs> One of them is fire. Give a me a of, fucking break. A lot of NES games back in the day had like sort of, some sort of stuff like that. If you your friendlies. Yeah, yeah, and you yeah, shot yeah, everyone yeah, yeah. fucking like. Also, Kukos and Zelda are very similar. Okay, so uh, yeah, you can do. You know, you can I do love that. how. Oh shit! I love right. how even though we're in the good guy base, the good guys are just dressed as these guys because they're both wearing purple. Um, these are members of the FSA and Bionic Commandery history tip number one. FSA stands for the Fe stands for Federal States of America. Federal States of America, is right? Because awesome. yeah, basically, uh, I'm down. After a super fallout and like shit goes horribly wrong, the apocalypse has had an apocalypse. Exactly, they come back together as the FSA. It's honor work with you. You're fucking rad. Um, I know. Look at these Shinkiro is, fucks. Shinkiro is great. If anyone wants to look at awesome Capcom art, please just Google Shinkiro. We're, that is Shinkiro. We're talking yeah, to right there. You're probably <laughs> right. You're probably right. Straight up. I'll give it a shot. Whatever. So you get your, your drops of story through this guy. You know, we're going to be working with him. You got to do the hacking. Yeah, you hack the enemy's base and you get what? You get intel on the enemy? You get, you get uh, like, cheats, pro tips on how to beat the boss. Usually. Right, right, right. And, like, doofy little conversations between the same guy with a couple variants of his face. Apparently, it only has one shield plate protecting out of the top of the bottom of the hole. Regardless, I think it's safe to say that it's fucking indestructible. I'm going to say everything. No one can impregnate this thing. We've tried, sir. <laughs> Flight control system can't be damaged by ordinary gunfire, only severely violent like a fucking grenade. Tracy Morgan wants to get it pregnant. <laughs> That's reassuring. It's real. I'm really psyched that Tr Tracy Morgan wants to impregnate my tank. We really tried knocking it up, and it just nothing works, man. It's not, it's not great. Uh, you also got your uh, uh, grenade toss, which we don't have yet. Oh shit! It comes a little later, if you recall. For now, we just got the gun. Also, what you can do from this early on is oh, shit. Uh, deflect bullets by using oh, your gra your your arm. Grap. Now I keep saying it like that because there's this one awesome Shadow of the Colossus 8-bit version that, like, the only meter that's there is the grap. Right, 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 right. You mentioned that one time. Yeah. Okay. So tell me about this bionic goat. Oh, shit. <laughs> Yo. You probably were wondering what the fuck is going on. I, I wondered the amount of posts that Wooly posted me today about something called bionic. Oh, shit. Oh, fuck. Split screen it. Oh, what happened to you? I, I didn't know that there was water under there because the camera. But, oh. yeah, I, I kind of... We have, we have infinite lives, right? Uh, there's a, I think there's a limited amount before you have to restart the stage. But, like, we can keep trying the area. So right. that's fine. But okay. you, you, won't, you won't always be able to get back to the exact same spot. Uh, so, part 2 has that. Okay. The, the thing I was a little bit confused about when I first played this game single player is, like, how exactly a level is set up. It's like every level has a boss, or no? I, I kind of forget. Every single level does have a boss. Um... Oh, whatever. You're going down. It's all good. Well, okay. You say so. It's safe, bro. Come on. Come on. Uh, He's standing on top of a barrel. What kind of vantage point is that, dumbass? <laughs> I'll, they're not explosive barrels, but I will stand on barrels that can be manipulated by the good guys. Right? Whatever. It doesn't mean it's fine. Um, oh, fuck. So, no. The new shit is... Oh, I threw it the wrong way. Where'd I go? Where did you go? Oh, I don't, I don't think I'm dead. Oh, you're, you're right in the corner. Area. But I'm right in a spot where the where the, the camera uh, will the camera will yeah. go. Let me get up. Like no, no, up. go in the elevator. Does the elevator go down anymore? Okay, oh, there you go. Okay, well, there you go. It might be a little bugger too. Anyway, the bionic goat is like the new shit going on on the streams, or basically. Whenever it's some sh on, on Wednesday night fights, whenever some hype shit goes off, like they get to bionic. <laughs> and like when some calmer cooler shit happens they cut to the bionic goat but like instead of the goat noise 
It's just uh, the, the, the MVC2. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Shit's great. Now, I give uh, Console Spencer a lot of shit, but I have to admit that uh, uh, Marvel vs. Capcom 3 Spencer is fucking high Bionic fucking arm, man. Oh my it, god. It's really because the voice actor just fucking he did put yeah. all of the passion <laughs> into that. He, he, he does it, he super sentizes it, basically. Basically, yeah, yeah. See yeah. that one, see what we did there? Hits her attack. Classic Sorry, military yeah. mover. <laughs> The military uses Bionic Command to rearm to train its new recruits. Confirmed. As they should. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um. Well, I could use that wipe, so. Uh. Yeah. Other, other factoid. Bionic Commando History. Whatever. Two, number two. Number, number 5,000. Uh. Rad Spencer is not actually rad. It's research I'm gonna and stop development you right there and Spencer. I'm going to stop you right there and just say that that's just fucking bullshit. Of course it's, that... It's totally research and development in one Spencer. He was the first bionic, like, soldier. So, like, he was the first guy that they got Now, together. this is a boss store, right? This is a boss store. Any, anything with little eagle. Anything with little Nazi eagle. That's not a Nazi <laughs> eagle. Because yeah. remember, it's not Hitler they're trying to revive. No, it's the Imperials. Master P P P. P, -P, -P. Internal alert. You, you can be Spencer. Yeah. Oh, keep quiet, you little chatterbox. Beep, beep, beep. What did you call me? <laughs> beep, 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 beep. That's it. Next stop, the junkyard. Population you. Beep, 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 beep. <laughs> gotta peep, gotta peep. Gotta peep, gotta peep. Okay. Pee over here. <laughs> Pee over there. Oh, God. Okay, so swing up like that, and then... Oh, yeah, there you go. All right, oh, so oh. what you gotta do... Uh, okay, I'll go up, you stay down here, alright? There's an armor plate, if you recall. Exactly. Oh, oh okay. And then... He's Tell gonna me what to do. He's gonna switch between... Oh, well, if Shit. I don't fuck up... Okay. He's gonna switch between so armor up above and armor below. Right. And then I have to throw a barrel, and then you have to throw a barrel. So he's like, fuck, I can't block both of them. Okay. So... Alright, now go. There you go. Unload. I wish you'd gunshot bastard. Oh, uh, whatever. Decent. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. oh, man, we fucked that up. Yeah. It was bound to happen sometime. Yeah. Now, it just kind of... You think you might have to actually blow up the barrel, but it just kind of hits the guy. It's just a grease. That's a crazy Peep, 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 motherfucker. <laughs> Mark IV style, motherfucker. Peep, peep, bitch. Hey. Best. Hey, we got the grenades. Yeah, okay, grenades, super sweet. Um, I like how Spencer is really intensely staring at area clear. Area clear. clear. He's like, fucking you, fucking you, clear. Dude, like, even sh the Shinkiro reimagining of Rad Spencer is great, man. Yeah. He's got the shades and the hair and everything. Hey. Hey. Terrific! Fucking badasses! You got the shit. Like, you know, imagine how much junk is in that trunk we can't see. Yeah. Right? You can't even handle it. They're not even Willie's showing us. suggesting that she has a large posterior. <laughs> Maybe, mayhaps a badonkadonk. <laughs> you received the badonkadonk radar, Rad. He's like fucking, fucking blinking all over the place when I pointed at you. She's like, I'll just shoot you with my helicopter. And he's like, right, okay, sorry. Junk in the theoretical trunk. So why are we here? Uh, we want to get usually a little power up or item thingy inside uh, of our own yeah. bases. Also, there's extra lives. Uh, so Ooh. here we go. What's that? I believe that is dynamite. What? Uh, what Flares. It's uh for oh. the dark areas. We can now see in the dark. You have anything interesting to say? No, you don't. Okay. Yeah. Uh, no well, bad. he told us that. Whatever. A lot of, again, NES games always had, like, oh, not at all, all of These rooms is how you get the bonus life up top. I'm going to be a cool guy and get it. Okay. Well. Worth it. You kind of got it in a cool way. <laughs> Worth it. Whatever. Fuck off. A lot of NES games had, like, dark levels that required, like, I know uh, a couple, uh, like. Yeah, uh, a torch. Uh, like, I think there's a, Capcom um, Disney games had that. Probably a Zelda game. Yeah. 
Those flares pitch black, fuck yeah! Amusement park! Thanks, Haley! Amusement park. Oh, commando mission! Nicholas. This is a mission throwing back an homage to the old commando games, Wolf of the Battlefield. Okami no Seijo yeah, or whatever. I remember whatever Wolf it is. of the Battlefield, the XBLA version, being one of the first things I ever downloaded on my Xbox and immediately Whoa. regretted it. Immediately regretted it because oh, it was dude. just so barely worth even playing. Yeah. Um, that's, play Renegade, that's another game that uh, I unfortunately have to spend a lot of time playing. Oh, right. Uh, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, you wow. Are, we, the, the goal of these, by the way, is to blow up the, um, the, the little truck thingies. Right. Even though, like, like, the truck attacked us, like, we have to go through a level to get the yeah. truck. So, yeah. But this is exactly what... The, and the deal with these are they're going in homage to the old games because you're going to save Super Joe, who is the original um, commander from Wolf of the Battlefield. Right. He's the guy. Oh, I didn't know that. Yes. Fuck, that camera is really weird. Bionic Commando History Factoid number two or three. Don't do that because then you're going to have to put a counter on them. I know. Don't okay. Do well, whatever. Way. Number 800. Okay. Uh, Super hey. Joe is not actually just Super Joe. It stands for Supervisor Justice Operations Executive now, Joseph Gibson. I, now, I am... I am could not be more down with that. With Backronyms, that, Yeah, that acronym. That's Backronyms pretty good are one. great. I'm the justice operator of all America. It's like, cause it's like, what kind of fucking stupid name is that for a military guy? Oh wait, it's oh, wait, the cool it's name. thing ever. Yeah. Pull those down. Yeah. We're construction bros now. Okay. There's our flares. Oh shit. Oh spikes. shit. Okay. Oh god. Not like this. Not like this. My boots are bitch as well. They're oh. really strong. Up, up, up. I'm dude. trying! <laughs> Fuck. It's okay. It's okay. Oh, we'll right. just, we'll just. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, man, no. Oh, in the, in the, uh, in the, like, rewriting and the reinvention of Bionic Commando, like, they went back and went, how fucking stupid did that sound? How do we explain how, it? Let's make it dumber. <laughs> well. Maybe. Flares, use your flares and make sure you can see the area too much fuzz, pitch black darkness. Oh crap, you better I stay it was cool. cool. For example, how many games had fucking jets that jet that sends you in with the name Cloud Splitter? What other game has that? Right. But it's also funny how we have to pick out these very minute, specific moments of the console Bionic Commando to justify its existence. Hey man, why you gotta... Why you gotta drop them truth bombs, man? It's just not cool, man. Did I fuck up? I think you might have. I done fucked up. Aw, shit. Whatever. <laughs> oh, no, the curiosity thing is being destroyed <laughs> because nobody gives a shit. Let's jump ahead 200 layers because it's taking too long because Peter Molyneux couldn't fucking get his shit together. What well, else is new? Like, I can't think of a few people that perpetually can't get their shit together. <sighs> With every game release, no shit you gets should, found dude, you hear, and put together. You should hear the arguments between, like, me and eight people on one side of the street yelling at Liam by himself defending Peter Molyneux. That's so random of him to... Because he's like, just give the guy a break, man. He got really sad. And, uh, and I'm like, no. and he's like, and there's a cool twist in Fable 3. And I'm like, I don't care about no, the twist. Hey, no one cares about Fable 3. And if you care, this then game, you should stop caring. They fell apart so hard. The only game the only there's two games that Pierre Molyneux ever made that were like worth a fuck and that was uh, black and way, white by the way the tip there was we gotta, hit, we gotta hit our boss, the boss in the back That's hit all. him in the back yeah. is black Honorable. and white I wanna say black and white one I, Populous I, well look, Keep, like, like no no no, no but, like I'm totally honest like I fucking really have a bone to pick with that guy as does most of the video game industry um but he was he was involved with Populous he was involved with Syndicate, and those are two games that really matter to me. I sure. love the shit out of them. Okay, um, but Fable. But, but there are a lot of creators that made like really awesome stuff way back in the day, and since then, like, can't fucking make a fucking piece of shit that no one can even. Or they tr they're trying to do things that are not okay. their thing. Fable one, fucking, you have to apologize for that because everything they said they were gonna do, they didn't fucking do. You you will be able to plant a seed in the ground and then uh, come back to it and visit it throughout and the game. Fable 2, it into a they didn't make all that many promises. Therefore, like, Fable 2 was pretty decent, like, uh, not those, very those memorable game. Uh, 
uh, go straight up. Oh, sorry, I heard no, shut no, up, no, 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 shut no, up, no, and I'm like, okay, oh, fine. Oh, 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 oh sorry. It was what? a life, but it's fine. We don't need it. I guess um, not. I'm still confused whether we need lives or not. <laughs> it's okay. We'll be fine. Um, uh, don't have the lasers yet, so we can't get through those. But Fable 2, and that was a completely serviceable game, and, and but it was. I, I played Dude, a lot of it. Lot I of played it. a bunch of Fable 2 as well. And uh, that you cannot say it was not a serviceable game. It's just not very memorable. I had I had a lot of problems with it because the bugs, dude, were fucking ridiculous. And it's sure. like, yeah, you got a cool dog, but you know what? That's not gonna make up for the turd of a game that you, you got going on here. It's like, not a turd. There were some. Fable really Three bad is parts. a turd because it it like completely different, and they just fucked it up. And then after he left, oh, of course, don't forget fucking Milo. <sighs> Hey, why don't we make a and pedophile the, simulator? And, and the, Maybe people will <laughs> like that. Uh, um, whatchamacallit, My Life as a King and Fable Adventure or Chronicle or whatever that was called. Then, then after he left, where he's like, company, I don't want anything to do with yeah, that. Yeah, his company just started making tons of shit. Not exactly his fault, but I mean, you could have stayed on and made sure people wouldn't destroy your brand. I mean, I would have done that if like, I was in that position. Me and my roommate just sat there and we were playing like uh, the Fable 2 player mode and then basically in one night, found the exploits for infinite gold, infinite XP, infinite, like, <laughs> fucking anything and everything. Like, it was so broken right out of the game. And, like, it's like, it's such a big case of, like, jack of all trades, master of none. Right. Anyway. And the fact that we was head of Microsoft Studios for so long and just didn't have anything, like, didn't really do anything. It was fucking Oh, Holy Christ, say, identify yourself. Perhaps you're that bionic nuisance! That has been grabbing all the badonkadonks lately. The bionic slubbergullion. <laughs> you think? How very observant of you. Oh my, how disrespectful. First but sir, make ready, engage! The closely fellas. This will be the last thing you see it before the light at the end of the time. That's pretty cool. <laughs> so who's first? Fuck you! <laughs> <laughs> See, 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 I I'm trying to do Faith Total No More Guy. Yeah, you like yeah, it? You're, 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 you like you're, you're, it? You're doing it. Yay. How do you like it? How do you like it? Can I get a explosion going on? Oh, God. Yep, totally can. Did you just kill him? Fucking wrecked his shit. Did you kill him? I killed him dead. Oh, you just gotta kill his dudes? Wow, that was easy. Yo, one grenade in the asshole. <laughs> Usually that's enough to kill most people. 